Social Insects Man is not only the living being that lies in society. Some animals such as elephants and deer and insects like honeybees, ants and termites live in a social structure. Among insects, we clearly find a division of labor like in human beings. Animals that lie together are known as social animals and they perform a number of activities such as feeding and providing shelter and protection to their fellow beings in a specialized manner. Most animals live and groom their young ones, etc. The social fabric of honeybees. The honeybee is a social insect that survives as a member of a community, community known as a colony. We can often see hives on trees. This is nothing but a colony of honeybees. The colony of honeybees consists of three types of bees. The queen bee, the drone male bee, and the worker bees. The queen bee is the only female bee that produces eggs in the colony and is thus positional as the queen bee to all other bees including the male bees, worker bees and even the future queen bee. The queen bee has a long body with a large abdomen and a curved and smooth sting. Its lifespan is between 1 to 3 years. The worker bees are sterile females which lack the ability of laying eggs. They do most of the work in the colony like secreting wax, building the honeycombs, gathering nectar, pollen and water, converting the nectar into honey, cleaning and defending the hive. The Drone Bee It is a stingless and defenseless male bee and its main function is to mate with the queen bee in order to increase the population of the colony. The drone dies immediately after mating with the queen bee. Ants When you drop something sweet on the ground, you will notice that ants immediately gather around it and they quickly carry it to some other destination. Ants work in groups to find food and shelter and also to fight enemies. One colony may have thousands of ants. You may have seen a number of ants moving in a line on the walls or floor of your house. Ants also have the tendency to live in a social setup and build underground homes where they live. Their colony consists of a number of chambers under the ground connected with other through small burrows up to the surface of the ground. These burrows are used to store food. Like honeybees, ants are also classified in three groups, that is, the queen, the male ant and the worker ants. All worker ants are females. Ants collect food which they store in their colony for future use. They also look after the eggs and clean the colony. They do not have wings, but the queen ant and the male ants have wings. The queen ant does not do any work except for laying eggs. The third category of ants is the male ants and they recognize the female ants through their smell. The worker ants are further classified into four groups according to the work they do. Soldier ants protect other ants by preventing entry of unknown ants into their colony. Hunter ants leave the nest in search of food. Nursery ants look after the newborn ants. Cleaner ants they clean the area where the eggs are kept. We all like to live together in a society. That is why we are called social beings. A group of families living together in a particular locality make a neighborhood. People who live near your house are your neighbors. People of a neighborhood share some common facilities like parks, roads, markets, hospitals, schools, place of worship, etc. On the basis of the number of people living in an area, the settlement is called a hamlet, a village, a town, a city. In cities, some people who cannot afford to have a house live on footpath, bus stops or on railway platforms. They are homeless people. We live in a society 
so that we can fulfill our basic needs of food, shelter and clothing. Most of our needs are fulfilled by the joint efforts of a number of people including farmers, laborers, mason, tailor, hawkers, doctors, teachers, engineers and so on. Social life centers around obtaining food and giving security to the members of the society. Society encourages us to exchange our ideas and knowledge with others. Society makes our lives enjoyable as we join together to celebrate many occasions.